What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boys Brandon and Edward. Here we're gonna be installing the MRF2, the Motordyne. So that's the spacer right there, right? Yeah, and then that's the MRF2. 516 spacers and the MRF2. Well, the first thing you do is you gotta take off the strut bar. So you take off this and then you get take this off and then this will come off. Dirt in there, huh? No, no, no. oil in there. What you talking about? How are you have a space? Look at this. Gas <laughs> <laughs> <Okay, let's> giveaway. <laughs> yeah, on these, the how small these are, and then on this one, a little bit longer. Boy, explain what the plenum does. I think it's just so that I could get like more air, like mid-range horsepower. Baby spacer comes off. Oh. It's supposed to be clean, but it's a DE. It's a DE life. Yeah. Okay, but these have to be torqued down to like two chugga chuggas. <laughs> right there? <laughs> or not yeah, I remember when I first put mine I was like this too I was like really hyped about it but now you get used to it after a while and you just feel like you need to do something else to make it faster <laughs> damn dude I'm still not used to it like these pulls feel so good like I really recommend this mod for anyone who has a rev up like that yeah, like it's definitely worth the money so or even if you just have a normal DE uh, putting a just a plenum spacer really helps all right guys that's gonna be it for the video one thing to note is that those bolts that we put on the plenum, they are torqued down to a certain specification. We didn't torque them down, but everything's included in the manual when you purchase the MREV2. So if you guys want to do it properly, you guys can go ahead and do that. Me and my friends didn't, we just kind of installed it, but it worked out for us. But if you guys want to do it the proper way, there is a proper way to do it. If you're looking to upgrade the performance on 350Z, I really recommend the MREV2. You could tell a big difference. That's like, I put other stuff like the test pipes and other little bolt-ons, but 
the MREV2 along with the plenum spacer, those things together, like you really feel a difference. Once again, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. See you guys next time. Peace out.